Hello, Chancellor. Hi, Josh. Hey. Where is he? I said, hello, Spread. Crossfire. <laughs> Hi! And hello, everybody. This is Kangaroo Island FTB. Aw, uh, yeah. Say what? So we don't really know what we're doing yet, but that's okay, because um, we have a spawn city, so we're going to show off what we've got so far. And um, yeah. we're going to do Kangaroo Island stuff, so it's going to be a bunch of us again. It's going to be a multiplayer series, <laughs> and we're going to do FTB together on this new server. So... Let's go take a look at our little spawn city. Fun times USA. Fun times USA. So this was fun. Uh, actually, this is the first FTB thing you can see on the server. Ooh, micro blocks. Micro. Ooh. 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 All right, enough of that. All right, let's head over here. So uh, we'll share the seed um, when I read. What the? Oh, what like? What'd you get? Some zombie meat? Snack. Yum. Uh, we'll share the seed in a little bit, so you know, if you want to kind of join along in this adventure. One thing we notice, though, is that every time you run the seed, the village is different. Different, I say! But it's still in this general direction, so if you, you'll you spawn over there, and you'll come over here. Man, yeah, it's silver. Was that silver leaf here before? Uh, on the old village. On this village, yes. So, so what do we got here? You want to want to read the rules for us? You can each have a floor. <coughs> Josh's Tower of Rules. Heart, read the rules as you go down. All right, this is Chancellor's floor. What do we got? Rules Tower. Dash Josh. <laughs> <laughs> hyphen, 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 hyphen. <laughs> it's actually equal no, sign. No world anchor, but feel free to use your loader. True. Plain tur please turn them off when you aren't on. True. Only keep two loaders active at a time, including quarries. True. That's two per person. Also true. All right, let's go down to the next level. What do we got down here, Cross? Feel free to oh, explore. Lord. Whoa. <laughs> but keep the bases near here for now. We will expand eventually. True. All miscraft stuff should be kept in the miscraft house. Remember, we can copy pages. Miscraft house, you say? Let me show you the miscraft house. What is this madness? Miscraft house. So, ooh, ah, uh, I like this one because it looks like a bird ghost made out of leaves, and it oh, is, it's for uh, the Mushroom Island Shore Biome. Well, that's how I've always represented my Mushroom Island Shore Biomes. Yeah, bird, bird leaf ghosts. Yep. And we have Gradient, which I'm guessing is for, like, the sky. Uh, actually, I think, oh, I remember Direwolf talking about that, but I can't remember exactly what it did. Oh, it's a good thing you said direwolf. This is, in fact, a direwolf server. So uh, we're not doing Minecraft anymore. This is going to be direwolf. Uh, we do have some farms set up. So we came in. Uh, we built some stuff legit-like. And this is uh, kind of the end result. And I also added Optifine so I could do the whole zoomy-zoomy thing. Zoom-zoom. Uh, let's see what else we got. So some other folks have been on. Stavos has been on. And Puka and Casey and... Uh, I don't think they know who Stavos or Puka are yet. They will. Oh, they know Stavos. Um, or you should. He's been some of the KI stuff. Uh, but we have some storage. What is that? What is that? Oh, basalt. Oh, we, someone went to a volcano. Nice. Um, we also have... What, what you building up here, buddy? A, a science fair project. What, what you making? Uh... Are you adding to the, the house or something? A red power mossy cobblestone generator. Oh, uh, okay. Well, we're going to let you... Moss. You want to explain how that works? Because I have no idea what the heck you're doing. <clears throat> well, I forget which version of... it's. It's been in red power for a while. I don't even know if it's actually still in it, but supposedly when you put mo cobblestone next to still water... Yeah. And it's not getting direct sunlight... Yeah. It has the chance to just turn one of these blocks into mossy cobblestone. Oh, and then it kind of like spreads from there like a mm -hmm. a, a mold. Yeah, and uh, you can do it with stone brick as well. And if you put stone brick next to lava, you can get the cracks. It'll make it'll make cracked after a while. Interesting. All right. I well. think the darker it is, the better chance it has to. I don't know. We'll throw some. We'll see how it goes. Science, you know. Science. We'll come back. We'll come check this out in an episode or two and see if we have any mossy. I think we're entombing someone. I'm out of sand. 
All right. Well, well Godspeed, you ugly building of mossy cobblestone. <laughs> <laughs> so let's see what else we got. Uh, more farms. That's the cactus farm. They're always fun because you can do things like this to people. No, 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 no. <laughs> uh, let's see. Oh, we got a bee house. Uh, but every, every time I come over here, I get like, poisoned Maybe and asked. stung. Let's see. Yeah, tropical queen. So far, I'm okay, but I better eat. We're going to learn about bees. Puka is going to be, I think, our bee expert. You guys have power. How did you get a tropical? It came with it one. It spawned. Hmm. Yeah. I Apparently, know, right? they're the really dangerous ones. Well, they poison you. They just poison you. We also and have... And I think if you wear beekeeper... Gear, you're, you're safe. You're yeah. Safe. So down here, we got lucky, and we dug it out and prepped it, but we haven't actually built the uh, grinder yet or whatever we're going to do. We have um, this. Oh, I know how to make a really easy grinder if we can find some quicksand. Quicksand, you say? Hmm. Mm -hmm. We do have a desert. Well... Usually quicksand shows up in jungle biomes. Oh. We do have a jungle biome. Let's go to, to the jungle biome. We'll make the, uh, now that we've done the tour, we'll make the rest of this episode finding quicksand. That'd be cool, because that's not in normal vanilla. And, I don't uh, know where the jungle is. We'll sacrifice cross into the, de oh. I, oh. <laughs> well, let's see. What's the only direction I haven't really explored? I haven't gone this way. I don't Sweet. think anyone's gone that way, except for the ravine. Oh, we good. have a jungle, we just don't know where it is. Well, apparently someone knows where it is. That's how we know we have one. I know we have one when we were uh, generating the world. Uh, uh -huh. Uh -huh. Well, we'll be back. Uh, I'm going to cut out, and then uh, we'll cut back in when we find the jungle. And there we go. We found a jungle. We are about oh, 1,145 blocks from spawn. Give or take. Give or take. Oh, golden butter, butter zombie. <laughs> Well, if I'm around here, I might as well gather some cocoa beans. Yeah, why not? That zombie gave me something. What? What? Oh, no. I'm gonna kill a cow and try to get some leather so we can get some bookage. We might be able to make our first uh, Mistcraft world a little later. Then we can all go there and cry. <laughs> like there's nothing here. Well, now that you have to find the pages. No. Yeah. You can't. Well, um, you can still make a random age. Yes, but you can't learn anything from it. Yeah, which sucks. So, what is, does quicksand look just like normal sand, or does it look different? It's brown. Okay. And I'm not seeing it in this vanilla jungle biome. We might need to find one of the extra biomes jungles. Oh, yeah. <coughs> right, I don't want to wipe out all the cows, but I wiped out a few. Let's see. Okay. Well, if that's not gonna work. So indigo die. That'd be good. You can grab that. We gotta make some project tables. Sweet. We found so some. Let's do. Awesome. So basically, it suffocates anything that steps in it. Uh, okay. And you fall through it slowly like a spider web. But, <clears throat> like, so if we put a single layer of this right underneath the spawner, right? Um, the skeletons will fall through it and they'll suffocate before they even drop out of it. So they'll die, and their items will just drop right below it. Interesting. Fancy. So we have to figure out a way, though, because I want to make sure we're also able to hit them with swords so we can get experience. We might mm. be able to hit their feet as they fall. Yeah, it might be possible. So we have to figure that out. I made a sh shovel as well. So let's leave it one deep and uh, push across into it. Why aren't you Whee! sinking? Oh, there you go. So if you so can you not get out of that? Uh, maybe if you oh, started there it goes. if you fell out the side. Oh god! Oh, sorry, that was my bad. I was shoveling at the same time as you standing under my shovel. No, I jumped into the quicksand and it started suffocating me. Oh, okay. And there's, there's more cows out here. Sweet. Yay! Where did my axe go. And we're running back to spawn. Running, 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 running. Ride. All right. So let's see, we've done a little tour, um, we've picked up some quicksand, we've looked at the rules of the server. Jump! Haha, <laughs> oh, how do I get off here? Jump again! And let's see, the dungeon's over here somewhere. Oh, I gotta store a bunch of stuff though, because I have a lot of garbage on me. Also, what do I do with these bees? Um, put them in the bottom chest that's by the devil chest. There should be some other bees and a few apiaries in there. Okay. I actually want to breed one. Eh, we'll wait. We can do an episode on bees and try to figure out what's going on with all that nonsense. 
We're gonna need Puka with us. Alright, all these proven frames. Maybe, I don't know what all this nonsense is. Let's just throw these in here. Uh, let's see here. Let's see, do I have any of this stuff on me? Put that away, put that away, put that away. Why do we have two things of cactus? There we go. Uh -huh. I don't know either. Someone's bad at organizing. <laughs> it's not either of us. And one piece of uh, pumpkin. I want to keep these shards a minimum because we're almost ready to make a uh, something cool. All right. We should have three. I have five total now. Oh, sweet. Yep. I'll save the scoop in that. Okay. So let's go look at this quicksand crazy town that I had a chance to work on. Where, where'd he go anyway? He's probably down in the dungeon. And now I'm just looking at something real quick. Carrots, carrots for everybody! <laughs> I'm not a rabbit, Josh. You can't fool me. Well, my carrots are delicious. Alright, I'll come down here. So we're thinking we might actually put a floor in? Hmm. That could be cool. So how deep do we... So we need to dig this too deep? Is that what you're thinking? Um, yeah, too deep will work. And do we well, still use water to push them in so we're near where the stuff drops? No, because we can put it right on... We can put the... They'll fall right onto the... Uh, the quicksand. All right. Well, um, let's dig it out and then uh, come back and see what it looks like. All right. So quicksand grinder is the coolest thing ever. What? Also Look at this. Yeah, it's super cheap. So they all spawn and immediately fall through, and all we have to do is punch them as they're coming down to get experience. You just have to punch them once. <laughs> I thought I punched that one, I guess I didn't. Uh, it's probably not guaranteed. Well, eventually... Well, at least this still gives us the potential to, you know, harvest them for... Because you can, From natural spawners, you can still get their souls, can't you? Yes, yes. Uh, we might have to dig down one more. I'm putting this barrier up so that we don't, uh... hit the, uh, jump into it. Oh, wait, I just did there. Yeah. yeah, interesting. So we gotta figure out how to make sure we get on. When I discovered this, I was really excited because I thought I was gonna be able to make a spider grinder. Yeah. However, spiders just fall through this. Really? Oh, because it's probably treated exactly like webs in the code. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm guessing. There we go. <laughs> totally safe. Oh, I got my head stuck. Now, on the one that I built, yeah, I used water to push it all on top of a transposer. Okay. And a transposer just picks up anything that lands on it. Nice, kind of like an obsidian pipe. Yeah. <clears throat> and then it just would pop it into a chest. Very nice. Very, very nice. Sweet. Well, we'll have our uh, shards of... Um... Minimum stern. Minium. Minium, and we have tons of uh, skeletons and bones, so farming's gonna be a joke now. Love it. What a great way to start off a server. So that's the other thing we should probably point out. This server's uh, not open officially yet for... Are we planting crystals? Is that what's going on over here? We're just putting no. some in. There we go. They'll, they'll spread Crisis and grow eventually. Did well, they? That, really? Yeah, you can make crystal farms. I didn't know that. What's the point? Maybe that's the wrong type of crystal. It's the wrong type of question. Oh, okay. Um, ow. <laughs> but, um, what was I saying? Oh, so this is going to be the KI server, so a bunch of the other KI folks will be on. They'll be in future videos. Uh, now they have access to this nice fancy spawner, ready to go. Nice village. And uh, I'm really excited. I think we're going to have some fun videos. What do you all think? Oh, uh, yeah. So. Yeah, so we're going to do FTB stuff together, so you'll see us kind of as we come up with our crazy machines. And then, um, yeah, who knows where we'll go. Leave comments if you want us to... Look at certain mods. I know we're going to be very soon starting with either uh, Red Power, Thermal Expansion, or uh, IC2. Two. Um, so we just got to figure out which one. And, uh, well, you'll see in the next episode. But if there's other mods you want us to mess around with, let us know. We have Mistcraft coming up. We have Thomcraft. Uh, we have Twilight Forest. Um, we have Bees. 
and Lord knows we have so many other things. There's like 60 mods in this pack. So, um, yeah. <laughs> Tree farms. <laughs> Science! Not my mossy thing worked. Oh, no way! Let's go oh, see really? real quick. There's one key part that I was missing. And no, angry zombie. Apparently... One second. Of oh. course it's always one key part. <laughs> I gotta come find... I forget where we built that ugly tower. It's by the church. Oh, yeah. Here it comes. Let's see what we got here. So it worked, you say, hey? <gasps> Look at that! The one part oh I was missing gosh. was that um, you needed one mossy block to start it. Uh, and then it spreads it. That's cool. Huh, nice. We can add generate mossy for some purpose. And it's legit. That's Although kind of we cool. are gonna have to make this prettier. Well, I'm gonna oh, at yeah. least turn it all to cobble. I'm taking the dirt out now. Yeah, that's kind of cool. cool. Yeah, I'll, I'll give you Science points on that one. Amazing. Eventually, I think we'll just for fun make one, an area to generate all the different stone types. Yeah, why not? Maybe yeah, Az Aztec will be now. happy. Now he can. Um, when he builds his pyramid that he inevitably will build, he has uh, lots of options. Yeah. Lots and lots of options. And uh, you said this is Red Power 2 chance? Yep. Alright, cool. That Elaram. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. There we go. And I guess we can put this roof back on and... Now it just looks like a weird cobble extension to the church, so. It's the crypt. Nice, I like it. There you go. Cool. Well. That is very nice. I like nice it. Ball. Harvest out of... Excellent, we'll just Jeez. put you both in there. Oh my god. They've been buried alive, and that's the perfect way to end the episode. So, uh, we'll see you all <laughs> next time on Kangaroo Island FTV. Say goodbye. Bye. Bye.